So last August 24, I was able to download and play the 2v2 alpha build of Call of Duty Modern Warfare. Not to be confused with Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare or Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. So the alpha build was free to play for the weekend on the PS4 and I hate to admit it but I'm actually quite impressed with what I've seen. The words to describe the new Call of Duty is that it's a breath of fresh air because a lot of OG Call of Duty players including myself would agree that the series have been suffering from franchise fatigue for a very long time because of how the games feel so repetitive. However, with this brand new iteration of the Call of Duty game, I think it may actually save the franchise because the game actually feels different. For many years, players have been asking for the series to evolve and it actually took almost 12 years for that to happen. Everything feels new such as the gameplay, the gunplay, the 3D animations, the visuals, and it is finally running on a brand new engine but most importantly, they finally removed the flinching. So let's talk about the new 2v2 game mode. Think of it as your standard SND game mode, but there are only two players on each team and you have 40 seconds to kill each other. But if both teams fail to eliminate each other, then the team with the most health wins. I personally enjoyed the 2v2 game mode and I bet it will be more fun playing with a friend. I think the small maps that were designed for this game mode is well done, however camping is still an issue despite the 2v2 game mode is made to discourage camping. Other than that, the new gun animations react realistically. It feels as if there is an actual kick to the gun you're using and the guns feel like they have an actual weight to them which is a nice Nice change of pace. But what also impressed me is that despite the new COD looking and feeling totally different, it is still an easy to pick up shooter and still has that chaotic fun that the series is known for. As for the technical side of things, the default TV audio is way too low however, if you wear headphones, audio is crystal clear and keep note that this is just my personal experience and if you have a fix for the issues I've mentioned, feel free to comment down below. Additionally, there is still no option to adjust my field of view in the game. I'm pretty sure that the field of view adjustment is coming to the PC version but it would be great if that feature would also come to consoles for a better quality of life improvement. I'm not sure if you're aware of this but the game now has mouse and keyboard support so if you suck aiming with controllers, you can now use mouse and keyboard but don't worry you'll only play against people who also use mouse and keyboard on PS4. Lastly, texture pop-ins have issues where sometimes there are some textures that won't completely render properly but hopefully that will be fixed in the final build. Okay, to end this video, I had a ton of fun but I still won't pre-order the game since this is Call of Duty. There's always room for disappointment so we still have to see what happens. Personally, I'm looking forward to the single player campaign since that was what the series was originally known for. Anyway, thanks for watching the video and I'll see you when I see you. Take care.